Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Royce, and welcome back to A Drink With Crazy. I have some awesome news, mm, and I hope it turns out to be awesome. Ghost of Tsushima is possibly getting a movie with an all-Japanese cast done in Japanese with subtitles. Holy crap. Let's introduce today's beer. We are doing Back Pocket Brewing, Murder Horn Golden Ale. I can't sip it because I have my Ghost of Tsushima mask on. This is the first time I've worn this mask. Let's get into the story. I am so excited. Yes! Ghost of Tsushima! Oh my god! Yes! <laughs> oh my god, I'm excited for this story. And yes, this is a this was a, a birthday present that a friend of mine bought me because he knew that my favorite game was Ghost of Tsushima. And so, yes, I I I, I decided to put the uh, the mask on for the first time ever. Uh, and uh, we'll just uh, I'll try to uh, hang it right there. I get I oh god, that's not this isn't gonna end well. All right, we're gonna put it right there. This is not gonna end well. All right, let's get into the story from bounding into comics. Stop asking me questions. Ghost of Tsushima director wants to film a live action adaptation in Japanese with an all Japanese cast. I'll read subtitles all day. You're damn right I will. If, if, and, and here's the thing. So the Ghost of Tsushima, for those of you that didn't play it, and I played it, oh my God, and I loved it. And it's actually, I, I still play it. Like, I'm on my, like, I have over 100 hours right now on my third playthrough because I'm literally just, I don't even, I'm just, it's my zen game. Like, I just, when I literally find a minute, I sit down and I play Ghost of Tsushima and I just, I just roam around and I just play that game. I'm not super worried about the story right now. I'm, I, I, may, I don't know if I'm going for a completionist run. Maybe I'm going for a completionist run. I don't know, but. I love Ghost of Tsushima. It is so fantastic. The director of Ghost of Tsushima live action... <clears throat> the director for the Ghost of Tsushima live action film is aiming for an all Japanese cast and Japanese dialogue, relying on English subtitles to make the movie more accessible for Western audiences. And Sony seems to be on board with the filmmaker's initiative. Yeah, you, you better be. Literally, the people who... Uh, the the uh, um, uh, Sucker Punch... The, the people who made Ghost of Tsushima, they were made, like, honorary Tsushima, like, uh, um, citizens or something like that. I, I can't remember that exact story, but oh my god, I am so excited for this. I love Ghost of Tsushima, and here's the thing, they if they do Ghost of Tsushima correctly in a film version, it would be, um, it would be paying homage to Kurosawa, right? Oh, oh my God! I am so excited for this. This this Sony announced a live action film adaptation of the Ghost of Tsushima back back in March 2021, directed by Chad St St Stelsky of the John Wick series. Oh shit! So we're gonna get still cameras, and I just turned my tablet on. So we're gonna get still cameras focusing on the action. Oh, they better get a good they better get a good cameraman for this. Oh, oh my God! A Ghost of Tsushima movie with the with the with the main photographer having photography like John Wick. Please, please God, please God, just just stick to the story that they. Speaking to Collider, uh, Stelsky explained why he took on the film. Honestly, it's probably the same thing that would scare the out of most people. It's a fantasy. It's a fantasy period piece. It is. It's done with reverence to Akira Kurosawa, yeah! <laughs> who's probably in the top five biggest influences of my life as far as film goes. Oh my god, I'm feeling excited. Sorry guys, I'm I'm gushing, I'm oozing. I don't. I love Ghost of Tsushima. It is my number one game that I have ever played ever, bar none, period, ever. Like it overtook Kotor 2 for me. Kotor 2 held that for me for a long time. I have a dog barking. I am so sorry. Hopefully you guys can deal with it. I am going to be working on getting some soundproofing stuff to block that. But all right, it's a chance to push technology and people in a story that's timeless. It's your typical mythological story of good versus evil. Finding a man, watching him change the world 
or the world changes him. And in Ghost of Tsushima, it's kind of both. If you played the first game, it's both, right? It's all, uh, uh, um, uh, hold on, hold on one minute. And with the magic of editing, you guys don't even know what happened. So, well, you probably do because I actually have my headphones on now. All right, uh, it's a chance to push technology and people in a story that's timeless. It's your typical mythological story of good versus evil, finding a man, watching him change, the world changes him. It's all the Joseph Campbell stuff that you'd love in a story. Stelsky praise. You put that in with, obviously, so I'm told I have a bit of a samurai fetish. What do you do in your bedroom, good sir? Which is probably true uh, from manga and anime stuff. Oh, it's about to get good. So I think if we did this right, it would obviously be visually stunning. It's character driven. It's got an opportunity for great action, great looks. And honestly, we'd try to do it all in character, meaning it's Jap it's a Japanese thing about the Mongols invading Tsushima Island, Stelsky elaborated. Yes! 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 I'm literally, like, my, my playthrough right now, I am doing the Japanese with the subtitles. It is so good. And, like, the Mongols actually speak Mongolian. Oh, it's so good. Okay. He then revealed this meant he wanted a complete Japanese cast in Japanese. Sony is so on board with backing us on that. I've been going to, to Japan since I was 16. I have a love of the country, love of the people, and love of the language. To try to direct not, on, not only in my language, but someone else's and culturally shift my mindset. Oh, good Lord. The ads are culturally shift my mindset to bring a part that in a cool way is still entices a West that, that still entices a Western audience. No, just do it. Just don't, don't worry about the Western audience because it was an homage to here's the thing that you don't understand. Possibly the samurai is tantamount to our Old West gunslingers. The stories are told in the same way. All you have to do is just bring the ghost of Tsushima to the screen and let people know how utterly fantastic this story is. Do Jin Sakai, oh my God. This is one of the, if they did this right and they're, if they did this right, this could be, become my favorite movie of all time i am so unbelievably excited about this yes all japanese cast all yes 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 to everything this guy just said yes yes be true to tsushima do it and do it right and oh my god if they could get the if they could get the permits and stuff and the filming stuff and actually do scenes on Tsushima. Oh, if they could do the filming on the island of Tsushima. Oh my God. That would be incredible. I don't know if they can. I don't, I, I'm not going to read. Guys, the ghost of Tsushima is something that I am so excited for. I, again, I still play it to this day. When I am, when I have my moments of downtime, I play that game. I got my wife into that game. She and I play the multiplayer <laughs> I need to buy a second PS4 so she and I can play it together. And then probably buy Ghost of Tsushima again. I bought it and it played Iki Island. I've, I I did that. I, I, I am... This is what storytelling needs. If they stay true to how the game told the story and how the characters drove the story, if they stay true to all of this, we are looking at a movie that is going to be utterly fantastic and it will probably rival John Wick. Unless you get the people... Oh, I don't like reading subtitles. Go fuck yourself, dude. This is a great story. I don't mind reading subtitles when it's a great story. I'm sorry, like Train to Busan. <laughs> Train to Busan is so good. Like, this is fantastic. I got my introduction to reading subtitles in movies from Passion of the Christ, okay? Like, so... Th that's where I got my introduction to reading subtitles. And now my wife and I, we have children and loud dogs. As you heard earlier in the house, we have loud dogs, we have children, we have all these things. And here's the big part about this. We turn on subtitles now so we can hear the movie and all the interesting stuff going on in our house. And we can still understand what's being said. I am un 
unbelievably excited about this. I have not been this excited about a movie announcement since, um, oh, Revenge of the Sith. I have not been this excited about a movie announcement since Revenge of the Sith when I bought tickets and I went with my sister-in-law uh, and I believe my, I, th- I think my brother, my, my older brother. Uh, so my sister-in-law, she, she, she drove me to the movie theater because I was a little kid. But I bought, I actually bought the tickets because I had money when I was a kid because I mowed lawns. And my, my oldest brother, uh, who was not married to this sister-in-law, but he wanted to make sure that we were safe. And my other brother just couldn't, he just, he, he had a different work schedule. And my brother just so happened to have the next day off and he came with us and we went opening night to Revenge of the Sith. I have not been this excited for a movie announcement since the Revenge of the Sith. And now knowing that it's by the guys who did John Wick or by one of the guys that did John Wick. Oh my God. Can you imagine those still, those still shots of just watching a samurai and then they back the camera up and they just follow him. And then the camera just follows his action and just one, no shaky cam. No, the action is going to be choreographed beautifully god i hope because i believe if i'm not mistaken the guys who did john wick were actually stunt people and they understand what stunts are like and that's why they fu- that that's why they their uh, uh main pho- uh, f- uh, photography uh, does what they do is to show the action and to make sure that the core the choreography is great i am unbelievably excited for this movie i I want to see Jin Sakai on screen now. I thought that uh, I, I am very much like, oh, if modern Hollywood does their crap, like it's going to suck. It's not going to be good. Oh, my goodness, Lord. What, oh, this could be so good. This could be so good. They already have a fantastic story. It's rooted in history. Yes, it is. Again, an adaptation of history. It's a fantasy adaptation of history. But it is so good. And it was so good that the island of Tsushima made the people of Sucker Punch honorary. Like, it was like they, they gave them like some sort of award and made them honorary um, citizens of Tsushima or something like that. Don't quote me on that if you know what I'm talking about. Guys, Ghost of Tsushima, the live action movie, is going to hopefully be one of the best movies that we will see in our lives. I cannot wait and for those of you who are here thank you so much for watching this video we will be live streaming tonight we'll be live streaming brawlhalla tonight on the channel and we hope to see all of you there uh watching us and i leave the i i I do leave the room code open so if you guys are brawlhalla players and you want to come in and completely beat the holy snot out of us you are more than welcome because that's what i like to do the live streams for thank you all so much for checking out a drink with crazy I appreciate all of the support that we have gotten, and I look forward to seeing you next time right here. Cheers, guys. You didn't see that. I did not just spill the beer all over me. I didn't spill the beer all over me. I'm a little too excited. See you guys tonight on Brawlhalla. Have a good one, everybody. Thank you for watching A Drink With Crazy. If you liked the conversation, make sure to click here to see more.